This video is sponsored by Invite to Elements. Hey what's up guys this is Wasi from FlameLineVisualEffects.com and welcome back to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial we will learn how to create this really amazing intro inspired from Call of Duty Vanguard. So without wasting any time let's get started. Can I get 500 likes for this tutorial? If yes please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Okay, so first create a new composition and let's call it logo and I am going with 1920 1080p frame rate 29.97 and duration 10 seconds long then click on OK. Okay, let's import our logo. You can also use text. Now place it into this timeline. Okay, now create a uh, rectangle shape layer. So go to toolbar and select rectangle tool then fill color set it dark black and then stroke turn off then double click on this uh, rectangle tool then press s on your keyboard then scale amount set it 200 now select the shape layer then place it below the logo layer now change the layer track mat to alpha inverted mat then make these two layers 3d by clicking here okay now turn on transparency now select the logo layer and then paint it to shape layer then go to beginning of this animation then set a then select this shape layer then press p on your keyboard then set keyframe on position then decrease the position very high something like this then go to around uh, 2 seconds then increase the z amount now select these two keyframes then press f9 to make them easy ease then open graph editor and then change the graph curve to something like this perfect now select this logo layer then press p on your keyboard then set a keyframe on position then go forward few seconds and then change the position to something like this now select these two keyframes then press f9 to make them easy ease then open graph editor and then change the graph curve Design better projects faster with Envato Elements. Get unlimited downloads of beautiful and ready to use template for your digital projects. Create more with premium design assets, video templates, mockups, fonts, presentations, photos, audio files and more. All with commercial license for extra peace of mind. Envato Elements will make any projects better while saving your time efforts and money get unlimited downloads with inverter elements and start creating today okay now create a new text layer so right click new then click on text and i am typing vanguard make it bigger and also make this layer 3d then select this layer then press p on your keyboard then decrease the z amount a little bit make it a little bit bigger now 
now select this layer and paint it to our logo layer perfect now select this text layer then go to the toolbar and select rectangle tool then create a mask something like this now go to around uh, maybe two seconds then set a keyframe on max path then go forward few seconds and then change the max position to something like this now select these two keyframes then press f9 to make them easy ease okay let's increase the max feather perfect it's the timing a little bit okay now create a new null object then select our shape layer then paint it to null one now go to the beginning of this animation then press s on your keyboard then set a keyframe on scale then go to end of this animation then decrease the scale amount a little bit now select the first keyframe then press f9 to make it easy ease okay let's ramp view it looks good to me okay let's create another composition and let's call it main then click on ok okay let's import our project files you can download this project files from Envato elements link in the description box below okay so first select our background then place it into this timeline then make it 3d then press p then increase the z amount very high now select this layer then press s make it a little bit bigger perfect now select our smoke layer then place it into this timeline then again make it 3d then change the layer mode to screen and then press p on your keyboard and then increase the z amount a little bit perfect now select the fire sparks layer then place it into this timeline and then again make it 3d then make it a little bit smaller and then change the layer mode to add now select the texture layer then press it into this timeline and then change the layer mode to add and, and make this layer 3d then press p and increase the z amount a little bit okay now create a camera so right click new then click on camera camera preset set it 50 mm then click on ok now go to the beginning of this animation then press p then set a keyframe on position then increase the position very high then go to around 6 second then decrease the z amount something like this 
Now select these two keyframes, then press F9 to make them easy ease, then open graph editor and then change the graph graph. Okay, let's ramp a bit. Looks good to me. Okay, now create a new black solid layer. So right click new, then click on solid, make it black, then click on okay. Now go to toolbar and select ellipse tool, then double click on it now select now click on invert then press f on your keyboard then increase the feather amount now go to project window and select our logo comp layer then place it into this timeline then simply select this layer and move it forward few seconds Adjust the time a little bit. Perfect. Now create a white solid layer. So right click new, then click on solid, make it white, then click on OK. Now select this white solid layer and place it below the black solid layer. Now go to around 5 seconds, then press T on your keyboard, then set a keyframe on opacity and opacity amount set it to 0, then go to around uh, 6 seconds or 7 seconds, then opacity value set it 100. Now select these two keyframe and press F9 to make them easy ease. Let's try and preview this. perfect okay now select our uh, smoke layer then place it into this timeline then mode set its screen make it smaller then press T on your keyboard then opacity value set it uh, maybe 10 now select this fire particles layer then place it into this timeline then change the layer mode to add our animation is complete press zero to ramp preview this Thank you very much for watching this tutorial, I will see you in the next video, till then peace out.